It's a good start for Wisconsin's defense because of the new front seven to get LSU to punt that first series. It's kind of back to the 80s, Sean. Old power football. High backs, full backs, tight ends. And then McAvoy gets his first career start at quarterback. Abdullah of Nebraska rushed for more last season and has returned. Trouble with the snap for McAvoy. Stabby. Third down and four. Big loss of two on that mishandled snap. McAvoy, good throw. Football, Derek Watt is the fullback. Gordon slipped as he tried to make his... Out of the gun, McAvoy. Gordon turns the corner and has running room along the far sideline. Corey Clement sharing the load with Gordon. And they handed it off on the fly sweep to Reggie Love, and Love is in the end zone. Wisconsin ball for the second time. The Badgers leading 7 0. Melvin. Any more in terms of what the exact injury was, but he obviously had motion in his extremities, and they're bringing him to the hospital for precautionary reasons. All right, thank you, Todd Conrad Zagzebski, the defensive lineman for Wisconsin. Here's McAvoy, a big reason why he is their starting quarter. yard line, first down, Badgers. You know, the most impressive thing about this is he's got a 6 6 frame on him. And he moves and reminds me a little bit of Terrell Pryor, the former Ohio State quarterback, which was the same size. He took his eyes off the receivers a little bit early, but he trusts his feet to do the work in which they did. And J.J. Watt down there. 13 games that led them to a 9-4 and four record. He's certainly a solid player. McAvoy. In high school, and his coaches moved him to quarterback, and he became a top prospect after just one year at the quarterback position. On second down, Melvin Gordon. Came to Wisconsin last year, didn't win the QB job, and played safety. and played pretty well. He's in trouble now and throws it away. Yards on the ground, somehow. Clapping his hands for the snap that almost surprised him. Now he throws a deep ball, and it is incomplete. Tanner McAvoy under center. Corey Clement was the running back. McAvoy faked. He had a lot of room to run. Threw instead. And, and Collins it, in coverage. Coach Ludwig is saying, throw it, throw it, throw it. Coach Anders saying, run it, run it, run it. Mm -hmm. And he threw it. He threw a dart. And again, building his confidence, the more he shows he can make those throws. Clement still the running back. And Robinson. One game disciplinary suspension. Wisconsin back to the line quickly. And they flip it out to Alex Erickson. One of the Tigers fell down. After a 14 yard gain, Clement 3 to 6. Second and five, Wisconsin after the LSU timeout. McAvoy lobs one over running backs. White caught 39 balls last year. Third down five, could be on the edge of field goal range. McAvoy, again, not on the same page. While well, he was at LSU, now the highest paid defensive back in the NFL. Five years, 70 million, the new deal with the Arizona Cardinals. And McAvoy on first down, his pass is batted down and then caught. And the star of the group, the right tackle. Melvin Gordon. Donnie. Third down and 14. Wisconsin leading by three. Under 11 minutes to go in the half. McAvoy. Spin. And Wisconsin begins at the LSU 31. Gordon. Take that tends to open it up inside, so they'll come back to that inside run, like here. Corey Clement. Here we go. McAvoy. Designed option look. That's a play they couldn't have run with. Gordon comes out wide, perhaps the fly sweep again. McAvoy, a screen the other way, and it's caught in the flat. And McAvoy went under center. Big hole for Melvin Gordon and a touchdown. Derek Watt's going to get the kick out, number 34 right there. Then you see what Todd was talking about, the ability to finish runs. And when he gets an open seam, he has afterburners and the ability to with finish. Melvin. 
Tanner McAvoy, under setter on first and ten for the Badgers, leading by ten under six minutes. Record for a pair of teammates in a single season. Gordon and Clement hope to break that record this year. Clement, that pinball. McAvoy, quick pass. Delwin flying in motion. Gordon. Wow. Down to a minute 50 in the half. All three timeouts left for Wisconsin as they try to build on a 10 point lead. McAvoy play fake, wants a deep ball. And it's, we said last night, we cannot just drop pass plays designed for one guy. McAvoy kept it and got called his last timeout of the half. It was a good job by Rasko. Not though, Todd, for his career entering tonight, 8.1 yards per carry, best among all active players. Six and a half tonight. Oh, he's going to improve on that average. Only one man can catch him, and it's Jalen Collins who will. The offense. Everything's a setup. Everything's a setup. 63-yard gain. Corey Clement in. They can score quickly on the ground. Tanner McAvoy throws incomplete. And the people load the box against them as much as you can, and they still run. Yep. Amazing. Big third down here. LSU trying to force a field goal attempt. McAvoy got away from the rush. McAvoy very close. Watt the fullback. Clement the tailback. Clement surges inside. Their the pads team. are lower than LSU's pads. Right there, Havenstein at six foot eight has leverage on number 91, Lockature. And you want to run over. Boys to take a three score lead. Wisconsin. Clement. Touchdown. Kenny Hill. Well, Johnny tweeted out Kenny football. He was tremendous. Tanner McAvoy. Going deep. Single coverage. Battle for the ball. And it's for 33 yards. But they're leading LSU by two touchdowns. McAvoy. Record in yards per game in his first year last year at LSU. Clement. Question though, would you think about going to Joel Stavi? Who was their starter last year? Passed for 2,400 yards, nearly 2,500. 22 Tiller still hurt. He injured it in the bowl game last year. Third down and four. Can they silence this crowd? Clement. Picks up a much needed class, the number two rated recruiting class in the country. Recruiting class, he said. Eight minutes to go. Play fake. Alexander puts pressure on McAvoy. Man open in the flat. It's awesome. Second and one. First is going to be a star. Miles Miles said last night, I think he's Glenn Dorsey. One of the great players in LSU history. Receivers, can any of them get open? That's the big question for the Badgers. McAvoy throws incomplete. Arneson couldn't.